checking in at less than 100 degrees. If you're in a nitro car, that's pretty good conditions. These guys don't have to concern themselves as much as pro stock cars, pro stock motorcycles, with the weather because, well, they're bringing their own atmosphere, so to speak. Speed City. That's John Bojek's wife's company. Married into the Harker family. Cam, too, on the side of that Toyota as well. About to make his professional debut in the New Englander. Mike Smith looked like for a second had a little bit of a problem getting that thing to bump back into the forward gear. But now, everything looks to be as it should. Leaning over the top of the Speed City car. That's a guy by the name of Johnny West, who has been at this game a long time. You see Mark Lyle over there looking at Mike Smith going, are you going to run or not? And apparently the answer is not. The New Englander goes silent down there on the starting line, and John Bojek will get to make his debut on a solo run. The Speed City Toyota, first time ever seen in competition. Well, it looked like the pipes are getting a little hot as it closed in on the top end. You can see those flames changing color down there. But it ends up going down as a 438, 4.383, 270.92 miles an hour. And hey, John Bojack, you're number one. Well, for now, by the way, career best numbers because that's his first official run down the racetrack. But if you are starting your career in a Nitro Funny Car, and you come out here and just make a nice, clean, smooth run down the boulevard. Not too much wrong with that. That'll give them a baseline that they can work with for the rest of the weekend. That's Johnny West, they've got down there working on the car, has been around these things for a long time. Trust me when I tell you, he's got a couple of runs under his belt. Really tune that baby up. So as we watch again on the NHRA.com instant replay, you can really see one of the pipes getting hot down there. There's a flame pattern change. This is the approach to finish line stripe, but John Bojek takes his Toyota to the number one spot. They've got Mike Smith's car pushed off the starting line and a tough break for the New Englander 